Could the city of Eagle annex the massive plant community of Avamore? That decision is in the hands of the city council and the mayor. Now, if they approve annexation, the fast-growing bedroom community of Eagle would get even bigger. Yes. A lot bigger, almost doubling in size. Last night, people went before the city council for the first time to share their thoughts on Avamore joining the city. And our Brenda Rodriguez joins us now to share more on that meeting. Brenda. Well, City Hall was packed last night with people ready to testify, those in support and those against the annexation. It was a long night with public testimony starting at 8 o'clock with Eagle Mayor wrapping up the meeting a little after midnight. Back in January, Eagle's Planning and Zoning Commission recommended against annexing Avamore. Last night, Eagle City Council members took that recommendation into consideration. In the end, City Council will decide what they think is best for the city, regardless of the recommendation or comments from the public. Right now, as you drive north on Highway 55, you'll see about 800 homes as well as mixed-use buildings in Avamore. When the planned development is fully built out around the year of 2060, there's going to be about 10,000 homes. If annexed, about 9,000 of those Avamore homes and 860,000 square feet of commercial space would be in Eagle, and at least 50% of the land would be protected natural open space. An analysis shows if annexed into Eagle, Avamore would bring upward of 21,000 new people into the town over the next 30 years. That's a 64% increase in population. And many worry that growth will strain services and resources like water and first responders, as well as Eagle taxpayers. Citizens of Eagle do not want to support additional services miles away in Avamore. Why should their taxes increase for some developers to get rich? And some who testified were in favor of annexation, saying that growth is unavoidable. And one said annexing Avamore gives Eagle more control over what happens to dozens of miles of land in the foothills north of the city. To turn away now will not stop changes to Eagle. It will not stop the growth or halt the trips or somehow lessen effects on our community. It will simply cede total control to someone else. And again, Eagle Mayor Jason Pierce wrapped up the meeting after midnight. They'll have to meet again to continue the decision-making process of this annexation. Growth still one of the big issues in this community. Brenda. We'll see what's going to happen there in Eagle.